trial is underway in Cincinnati that could cost Fifth Third Bank more than $400 million. Reporter Dan Monk joining us in studio covered opening statements in this 10 year old lawsuit. And so, uh, Dan, explain a little bit more of what the controversy is all about here. Well, Craig, this is a class action lawsuit on behalf of more than 400,000 people who got cash advances from the bank's early access loan program between 2008 and 2013. Now, Fifth Third customers claim they were charged much higher interest rates than the bank promised in contract documents. Now, the bank's attorney argued this morning that the customers knew they were paying $1 for every $10 borrowed, but now some want to rewrite their loan agreements using an annual percentage rate disclosure that was never intended to define the cost of the loan. Natalie Martin teaches consumer law at the University of New Mexico. She was surprised Fifth Third took this case to trial. The law requires the lender to state the APR accurately. So I don't find it to be relevant what the parties understood. What's relevant is what's actually in the contract. And if there's a conflict between this APR that was stated and what was told to the consumer, then the consumer is entitled to the more beneficial interpretation of the contract. A plaintiff lawyers told jurors that Fifth Third customers paid $440 million more than they would have paid if the bank's 120% APR estimate was actually applied to the loans. The jury trial is expected to wrap up early next week.